Welcome back to the Rising of the Shield Hero Anime Review Episode Number Eleven. This I'm viewing the thirty-first episode of the anime, which is also the sixth episode of season two of the series, Raising to Catch Up. Which, and I looked up basically what this chat was episode after, and yes, this episode is pretty much finished adapting book seven. Mm -hmm. Well, we pick up a lot the last time with the whole thing of the book hero. Mm -hmm. Where, and also, it's real in this episode that they actually are able to stop the heart, the stop stopping the hearts, and, well, to reason why they have to regenerate, because apparently the book hero has got his hands on the other three heroes. And Risha basically is like, is basically worried about the bow hero because she's in love with him. Mm -hmm. And they, of course, he, well, they try to attack him, of course, various attacks on him, it doesn't really work. Then, of course, he's able to stop. Thanks to the fact somehow Risha is immune to the gravity attack. Yes, he uses a gravity attack on it, and Risha's immune. And, of course, the suit she was wearing is completely destroyed. The the bird suit she's using. Also in this episode, the Filto Queen shows up. Yes, the queen that Philo met in the last season of the show. She comes back here. She basically takes on... She, she basically goes with chopping up the head from the outside. While basically Glass, Lark, and Teresa, along with Philo... Go take out the heart. And of course, they're able to open, uh, open up a doorway to where the heart is. And and of course, Locke asks why she came along because she could talk to, to the Fiddler Queen. Like, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, they were talking things to the cow like on her head, which I think is quite hilarious. Yep, and they're taking out the heart, no problem. As the book came this like they did destroy the barrier, and the, of course, this vice is destroyed. And pretty much in the way the Spirit Taurus has pretty much been defeated, but. The, the souls that basically he took were not returned. So he's able to go back to Glass's world and Glass, Lark, and Teresa are back home with thanks to the portal he opened up. And of course, it seems like that the should here to Nafumi really wants to go there too, but he can't. Apparently, it's against the rules for a cardinal hero to be in their world, despite the fact that he's already doing a problem. But then he gets special permission from OC. Yep. Yeah, also, the reason they would destroy the, destroy the actual well, device that's there, because it's granted the power of the Spirit Taurus Heart Shield. Gives him wings, basically, and also destroys the damn thing. Also, it's revealed by OC that the Wrath Shield they first got in the previous season of the show, yeah, he's no longer able to use it because he's no more hatred inside of him. The hatred is all gone. Yep, so thanks to her, basically, we have no more rap, rap shield anymore, which, yeah, that's kind of a good thing, given the fact that the thing actually kind of hurt him, turned almost nearly killed him. I'm telling you a lot, first time you use it. So, thanks to, of course, giving me a special mission from the Spirit Tortoise, where she apparently dies. Though, they do change her positioning in the, in the episode, because in the book, the picture I saw, she was leaning, on, leaning against a wall. In the anime, she's basically lying on the floor. Uh, it's kind of weird the changes, but she's able to convey this no problem. But can they anybody point out the fact? Oh, she's a is a beautiful woman. This why I mean, of course, she's able to be the actual spirit of. She's the actual form of the spirit tortoise, and with the thing destroyed, she's basically able to die. And of course, they would hop. And of course, you have Nafumi, Reptalia, and Philo going to help with no problem. And Risha was supposed to stay there to take care of both hero. Risha's like, no, I'm going with you. And, of course, they hop through the end of the episode. And this sets up a arc that will be explored in the next two books of the series, books 8 and 9. Where Nafumi, Risha, and Philo, Raptalia, basically, they're all, well, they get something really weird happens when, when they hop to this other world. And this basically takes up the next two books. Yeah, we're going to go to the Glasses world. And I'm like, wow, we're going to this, this quickly? Yeah, they basically... Yeah, it's kind of weird they skipped over the training arc, which took a five chapters in book six. And now we're going straight to the other world story arc, which is like, wow, is it with the spirit tours in six episodes? Well, no, this was actually a two book story arc. And here it's like six, ep like six episodes, all done. Yep, finishes up really quickly. You could say they partially did the book six in, in these episodes and then pretty much the entirety of book seven. Uh, no little change. It's like maybe I think the only thing they made like was basically internal internal thoughts, but mostly, but it's mostly the same thing here. 
I guess that Tashi wise, this actually does a really good job here. And they integrate basically the final chapter of the epilogue really well in here. Though they no doubt the side story, probably because basically it's a side story. So, next episode, we're going to start adapting book 8. Mm -hmm. And if you're curious, though, like, how far... Now, here's the thing. This season was confirmed to be 13 episodes. We we're only 6 episodes in, which means we only have 7 episodes to go. <clears throat> Do I think we'll get through the entirety of the, um, the arc of the other world stuff? I don't know, if you think about it. Yeah, the other world stuff is not exactly very long, per se. No, it's like I said, it's only like two books. And with basically next episode, we're going to start adapting book two. No, two. Uh, eight. Yes, we're going to start adapting book eight with the very next episode of the series. Mm-hmm. But we're going to find out exactly, well, let me... Now, if you're curious, though, how many chapters are in book um, eight? In book eight. Now, book seven had, if I get the thing working properly, here we go. Book seven had 15 chapters. This episode pretty much in the way adapted the last two chapters was the epilogue. But not the side story. Next book is 17 chapters plus an epilogue. Mm-hmm. And this is the New World story arc. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In the manga, they basically start adapting this one already. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they basically... So, with next episode, we're going to basically go straight to this one, which is quite interesting to say at least. Yeah, it seems as though with the Spirit Tours arc, it's not exactly very long. It's only like about six episodes, which is... Kind of strange, given the fact it does cover this stuff here. Mm -hmm. Yep. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this particular view. Uh, stay tuned for tomorrow, because I don't have more time to review this night. So, tomorrow, if I get time to, I'm hopefully going to do at least two comic works. I have two ready to go. I might have more. I also might have ready to go the anime Detective's Already Dead. Okay? Thanks for you. Bye.